um welcome back to my channel if you don't know me my name is kelly i'm a thread up i'm a part-time thread up seller on thread up <laughs> so i used to sell on like ebay poshmark mercari but now that i am full-time medical student i am just selling primarily to thread up and so far it's going very well so today i have a dollar day haul for you guys i have been going to dollar day a lot lately and um just picking up stuff to try to keep my cost of goods down very low because thread up payout thread up payouts are everywhere <laughs> you never know so i definitely want to maximize make to get the most out of my time get the most out of my money so keep those costs of goods low so yeah been going to dollar day been picking up some pretty good stuff and i'm going to show you guys what i have found so this is over like this is like this is cumulative so i've been picking this stuff up i've had this stuff basically for probably like a month i've been going to dollar a day in like probably like two two weeks so but this stuff is like it's been sitting around my house for a month i wanted to do the haul so here i am doing the haul i'm probably going to be cutting some of these tags off as i show you guys I haven't done that yet like haven't made time for anything with school going on so yeah so let's just get into it and i'll show you guys what i got so is lululemon leggings haven't found lululemon in a while then again i haven't thrifted in a while so so they have this back zip pocket and these were not a dollar actually but they were still a good price really cute i think this is an older style because the like lululemon side is on the leg i believe that's what it means so there's a sign what size are they no size tag so if you don't see the size tag just look in the pocket and they are a size four let me get closer yeah size four so cute 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 and might try to throw these up on like facebook marketplace facebook marketplace all my Ooh, I mean, sells there and it sells really quickly. Next is by Johnny Was. So when I found this in the Goodwill, I actually started to throw up tag on it. So yeah, it's an older brand, definitely an older style, I should say, of Johnny Was. That is in their newest looking label. So it's a size small. But I was like, okay, whatever, it's a dollar. Let me give it a try. So it's got this pretty floral embroidery button detailing. So we will definitely you know see how it does and that'll be that okay move this over and yeah okay next we have so i picked up this ann taylor loft skirt it is a size large only because really it was new with tags. I mean, we'll see how it does. We will see how it does. Just a striped sweater skirt. We are in moving into fall. Maybe somebody will be looking for this. We'll see. Next item, Cynthia Rally. Size four, Cynthia Rally. Here is the tag. Um, pretty eyelet blue dress. Definitely something more so for summer. But again, we'll see how it does. We'll see how it does, definitely. All right, so I'm trying to pick up like more like blazers and jackets now that we're moving in. Now that we're moving into fall. So I picked up this Talbot <laughs> size eight coat. Here's the tag. So Talbot size eight coat, it is, it's a cute coat. I mean, somebody could definitely be looking for something like this. So yeah, we'll definitely see how it does. Nice style. It was a dollar, so can't lose. Maybe I could sell it for like, I don't know, like $50 on thread up, $60 on thread up. Even if I'm getting $10, $10 or more is my goal. $10 or more is always my goal on thread up. So I definitely think I can at least get a $10 payout with that. Next is this adorable skirt I kind of want to keep. It's J. Crew Mercantile. Size 10. And 
this is actually not my size this looks huge this looks huge for a size 10 i don't know but yeah this is really cute cute red mini skirt love 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 it i'm not sure how much i'm gonna get for it on thread up j crew is not uh, not something that gives you a lot of money there pays you out a lot of money there um i know i sold one item it was j crew factory outlet it actually wasn't even new with tags and i thread up bought it for me and i think i got like a 15 20 payout so that was really good but then i sent the same exact dress different color brand new with tags and it didn't sell so weird but whatever what am I gonna do <laughs> you know so okay next item moving on it's kind of this lightweight sweater jacket type thingy <laughs> from Victoria's Secret so I don't think this retails for much throw out prices this for much on the site um doesn't not that it retails for a lot it was a dollar so again i was like okay whatever i'm just gonna try it out it's a dollar you know so we'll see i mean again we'll see how it does if i can get something for it i can get something for it and that's good i got some money back so another blazer this is to hari author s levine <laughs> size 12 so it was a dollar again trying out the jackets trying out the blazers somebody might be looking for something like this decent size so we'll see how it does never sold this brand before but we shall see this is a learning experience <laughs> so we'll see what happens what is this hold up So this is by Lane Bryant. It is a very pretty uh, floral shirt with these uh, bell sleeves. I like the bell sleeves. Button front detail. Cute, cute, cute. Very cute. Here's the tag. Size 26, 28. This is definitely something I would have like picked up and sold on my own if I was still selling like Poshmark or, Mac or Macari or eBay. So yeah, this brand... This brand, depending on the style, where we I'm looking for the tag. Where is this tag at? So I can cut it off. So yeah, this brand usually does do good for me. Typically, and again, that is depending on the style though. It just really depends all on the style. But I think this is a really good style. I definitely think this will sell without issue. So sending that off. Next is this BCB G dress. Cut that off really quick. I remember seeing this and it was like $10 and I was like eyeing it down. I was like, okay, I'm waiting for them to drop the price on this. And then got the dollar day, it was a dollar and snatched it up. So BCB G Max Azure, size two. Just a cute little mini dress, pretty colors for like spring or summer, but we're gonna send it in anyway <laughs> and see how it does. Okay, this next jacket is by Chico's. Um, thought it was a nice little print. Thought somebody would really like this. Nice little print going on. Um, kind of like a snake skinish, not really ish <laughs> type print. Um, here's a tag, Chico's size one. So, We'll see how that does. Have I sold anything from Chico's on ThreadUp? I don't think so. No, I haven't. I haven't sold anything from Chico's on ThreadUp. So we'll definitely see how that does. Next item, International Concepts. So thought this was a cute little sweater. It's like, like a peplum, kind of like peplum style going on. It's textured cute great for the holidays coming up red 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 who doesn't want red so size medium <laughs> so yeah definitely we'll see again i don't think i've sent this brand to thread up either so we'll see how this brand does next we have 
this is by Weston. I think this is sold in Anthropology. So it's just this polka dot lightweight top, um, size small, again by Weston. So very cute, casual, simple. Uh, yeah. So we'll see how that does. I haven't sent too much thread up. I mean, I haven't sent too much anthropology to thread up. So we'll see. And we have free people. So this is free people. This is a size small. It's one of their tags. I don't think that's the newest tag, but one of the tags. And it is just this mini dress. So it's like a turtleneck yeah turtleneck mini dress really cute very cute might try it on <laughs> see how it looks <laughs> but yeah um i have sent items from people from free people to throw off i think only one sold so we'll see we'll definitely see what happens i mean it's a very basic solid piece so i'm not expecting to get tons for it realistically Mm, maybe sell it for 30 bucks if I'm lucky so we'll see again only pay a dollar didn't they break the bank for this stuff so <laughs> I'll make some money back these kind of brands bring in those daily sales so that's always good and next is this item I believe this brand is sold at um like I would see that TJ Maxx and Marshalls I just saw the tag Blue Rain, Blue Rain, there we go, size XL. So I got this because jumpsuits do well for me as far as like selling them on my own. Jumpsuits do well. I might even post this again on probably like um, Facebook Marketplace. Facebook Marketplace, um, things have been selling for me and I've been doing pretty decent on there. Is this something that's gonna sell super quickly? No, but it could potentially sell on there. I'll set the thread up first. And then if I can't sell it through thread up, I'll definitely list this. Um, jumpsuits always do well from person personally selling that, um, jumpsuits. <clears throat> I don't know how they do on thread up. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> I don't know what is in my throat. It's a little hot in here. Okay, next is London Times Petite. I've never sent this brand in. I don't know if this is sold at Macy's or something. I don't even know. But I thought it was a nice print. I thought it was a nice print. Somebody could wear, you know, to the office, something like that. <laughs> I don't know. So, yeah. I did like it. So, we will see how it does. <laughs> okay, moving on. Oh, this is pretty. What is this? What is this? I don't even remember buying this so. This is Macbeth Collection by Margaret Josephs. Macbeth Collection. I'll have to look that up. <laughs> Don't remember if I'm being honest. Again, I bought these things like a month ago, but I thought this was a pretty little drop waist dress. Perfect for like summer, perfect for spring. Um, Super cute. Love it. Love the floral print. We'll see how it does. Ow, I just hit my foot. <laughs> Uh, next is by Bowden. So this is a size US 10 Petite. US 10 Petite size uh, Bowden. I don't, have I sent? I sent Bowden in before. I sent a tunic top in before. It has not sold. I did have to reclaim it. So we'll try. We'll see what happens. Moving forward, probably won't be sending Bowden in again because it seems like it doesn't do well, so. Next, we have Joe B by Joe Ben Bassett, size X large. I see this brand at again at Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Cole, so not crazy expensive, not expensive at all actually, but I just figured, you know, we'll we'll see how it does. Again, I never sold the brand before, so again, we'll see how it does. I'm not expecting to get much, realistically. We probably like a three dollar payout, but I make some money back. And yeah, 
Okay, let's see. So, next item is by, I think this is DKNY. I actually think I remember this one. DKNY jeans, size medium, peplum top. I think I was thinking about like keeping these for myself, but I was just gonna send it to them, see how that brand does. Not expecting to get much, but whatever. So this last item, no, it's not the last item, but this next item is by Renee Lazard, size 36. It is one of those higher end brands that retails for a lot that nobody has ever heard of. <laughs> so I think this retail, maybe 400, maybe 500. Of course, I'm not expecting to get that on thread up. Hopefully I can get $100 for it. Basically, basically what I was going to say is I think it's a uh, a cutest style not for me but a cutest style a cute style for someone else <laughs> so hopefully i can get like a hundred dollars for it we'll see i'm not gonna be too greedy i do like i do like to max my prices out though and then i don't know i'm gonna try something new i'll talk about that in a separate video i was thinking about like in my, let max my prices out but then maybe drop the price after a week to the price I the, to the lowest price I'm willing to get and then that way just and then never really look at it again honestly so I'm doing less work so I'm not going in every week or whatever changing prices every two weeks changing prices so less work for me so we'll see we have so next we have these pair of lucky brand boots so it's like a, like a wedge boot. Um, cute for cute for fall, of course. Seven and a half. So you want some fall boots right here. Look no further. <laughs> so yeah, these are cute. We'll see how much we get on for them on thread up. Um, not sure how much they're gonna price them at. I didn't look these up. They were just a dollar, and I was like, okay, let me grab them. Why not? All I have for you guys. Um, definitely gonna continue to go to more dollar days pick up more items, love leaving that, love having that price of goods down low, keeping that down low. That is always the goal, either free items or it's just completely, I don't even know, what am I saying? I don't know, <laughs> what am I saying? Anyway, okay, thank you guys for um, checking out my video. Don't forget to turn on notifications so you know when I post my next video. Like this video. Please subscribe to my channel if you have not already and I'll see you guys next time.